Ja, hallo und herzlich willkommen zusammen. Wir begeben uns mal auf den Weg. Ja, wir starten hier neben dem Omega 4 Relay. Wir haben ja schon gehört, dass die Kollektoren daher kommen. Wir sollen nach Omega. Wir sehen ja schon, da können wir drei Leute rekrutieren. Aber zuerst geht's mal. Äh. Ja, doch, Surf und Nebula. Den Schlangennebel zur Citadel. Und wir müssen jetzt hier leider immer ähm, Benzin nachtanken. Und ähm, Sonden kaufen, um Planeten zu scannen. Das Planetenscan werde ich... Ähm, wahrscheinlich größtenteils auf Screen machen. Weil das ist recht offensichtlich nur zur Zeitstreckung. Wenn wir nochmal zur Citadel fliegen, werde ich das hier auch ausblenden. Weil das ist jetzt wirklich nicht so relevant. noch eine kleine Anspielung auf die Proportionsstudie nach Vitrov. Ähm, und ihr seht schon 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Und ähm, ja, da gibt es halt auch sehr viele, die sich so ein bisschen drüber lustig machen, dass äh, ja, das Shepard, äh, ich habe sie, bzw. ihn, ja schon als Space Jesus bezeichnet, ähm, dann mit quasi zwölf Jüngern unterwegs ist. Und Lazarus, ähm, Lazarus war natürlich auch ein, ähm, ein Mann, der gestorben war, den Jesus wiederbelebt hat im Neuen Testament. Ja, hier nochmal die Keeper. Got problems with collectors? Try Kasumi's credit services. Please tell me your password, Commander Shepard. Silence is golden. Good to finally meet you, Commander Shepard. Kasumi Goto. I'm a fan. Ich, es nervt mich gerade dieses komische M, ähm, aber ja, sei es drum. Has Cerberus filled you in on the mission? Honestly, I'm shocked they didn't come to see me sooner. My fault for being hard to find, I guess. What's with the password and the sneaking around? Are you in trouble or something? I'm the best thief in the business, not the most famous. Need to watch my step to keep it that way. I also needed to make sure all this was legit. And I have no doubts now. You're the real Commander Shepard. What makes you so sure? There's a certain aura about you. Like you've seen things no one else has. Even without knowing what you looked like, I knew it was you. What brought you to Cerberus? That's a bit of a story. Short version, they were looking for me, so I trailed them to find out why. Turns out they were looking for someone to join you on an important mission, and were offering a serious signing bonus. I had a thing I needed help with, so I made them a deal. And here we are. I assume this deal is something I should know about. Yeah, I guess it slipped their minds. I'm looking for my old partner's gray box. A man named Donovan Hawk took it, and I'm planning to get it back. What's this heist you're planning? Not here, Shepard. You'll get a briefing when the time comes. I need time to nail down the details anyway. I've taken the liberty of getting you some evening wear, though. You want to look presentable. What do you know about Donovan Hawk? Mr. Hawk is a well-respected businessman. Arms dealer, murderer, generally not a great guy. His mansion's famous for being hard to crack, but I have a way in. And I think you're gonna love it. I doubt Hawk's the kind of guy who takes kindly to people sneaking into his house. I always expect trouble. That's why you're here. I assume a gray box is some kind of hardware. It's a neural implant. Illegal in most places. Stores memories, thoughts, secret codes, illicit information. This one in particular? 
belonged to my partner, Keiji Okuda. We worked together for a long time, before Hawk killed him. Tell me about this former partner of yours. His name was Keiji Okuda, the best hacker and entryman I've ever known. Unfortunately, he slipped up and made himself infamous. He stole something he shouldn't. He warned me it was bad, something that could spark interstellar war if it got out. That information... got him killed. What could he have found that's so bad? He wouldn't say what it was, just that it was dangerous. He said if it got out, humanity would be in trouble. He encrypted it, wrapped it up in his own memories. To decode the information, you have to sift through all the time we spent together. Now those memories are all that's left of him. I can understand why you'd want to get it back. Getting it back will be easier with your help, Shepard. If that's what Cerberus <coughs> promised you, we'll get it done. It'll be fun. And if we're lucky, you won't even have to draw your gun. Ich bezweifle, dass wir so glücklich sein werden. We should probably wrap this up. You look pretty silly standing there talking to an advertisement. See you on the ship, Shepard. Crewmitglied Nummer 3, also zumindest Squadmitglied. Und ähm, Kasumi ist auf jeden Fall, ja. Can I help you, ma'am? It's been a couple years since I passed through here. Security seems to have tightened a bit. After the Geth attack, there was a review of security protocol. A few minor changes were made to reduce the risk of Geth infiltration. We apologize for the inconvenience. You'd think a Geth would stand out. Assumptions are dangerous. Be alert, be safe. Thanks for your time. Next. This recruits is a 20 kilo ferrous slug. Feel the weight. Every five seconds, the main gun of an Everest class dreadnought accelerates one to 1.3% of light speed. It impacts with the force of a 38 kiloton bomb. That is three times the yield of the city buster dropped on Hiroshima back on Earth. That means Sir Isaac Newton is the deadliest son of a bitch in space. Now, serviceman Burnside, what is Newton's first law? Sir, an object in motion stays in motion, sir. No credit for partial answers, maggot. Sir, unless acted on by an outside force, sir. Damn straight! I dare to assume you ignorant jackasses know that space is empty. Once you fire this hunk of metal, it keeps going till it hits something. That can be a ship, or the planet behind that ship. It might go off into deep space and hit somebody else in 10,000 years. If you pull the trigger on this, you are ruining someone's day, somewhere and sometime. That is why you check your damn targets. That is why you wait for the computer to give you a damn firing solution. That is why, serviceman chum, we do not eyeball it. This is a weapon of mass destruction. You are not a cowboy shooting from the hip. Sir, yes sir. Ich mag seine Ansprache. Obviously security has tightened since you were last here. Shut it down. What? Do you seriously think? Yeah, okay. Sorry for the inconvenience, ma'am. Our scanners are picking up false readings. They seem to think you're... dead. I was listed as missing in action a couple years ago. Would you mind checking in with my captain? He can reinstate you in our system. He's just past the scanners on your right. You'll have to make him scream a little. He's not gonna tell you everything just because you ask. I, I know, sir. If you don't have the stomach or you're worried about being reported, I can take care of it. No, sir. I can handle it. Captain Bailey. Yes? I see the problem already, Commander Shepard. My consul says you're dead. You're not worried I'm some imposter claiming to be me? We have the best screening equipment in the galaxy. Those scanners can sample DNA from skin flakes. Hell, if you have unregistered gene mods, they can even figure those out. Your sergeant said you could help with that. Usually, you'd have to go through the station security administration to reactivate your IDs, then to customs and immigration to regain access to the Citadel itself, and probably a stop by the Treasury. Spending a year dead is a popular tax dodge. But I can see you're a busy woman. So how about I just press this button right here, and we call it done. Das war übrigens eine Anspielung, also das mit dem Spending Year Dead ähm, war eine Anspielung auf äh, Per Anhalter durch die Galaxis. Couldn't one of us or both of us get into trouble for that? 
There's no way to fool the DNA scanners in that tunnel. You're you. Why wait in long lines and fill out a mass of useless hard copy paperwork to get to the same place? The Council does everything by the book. They've had thousands of years to write it. Sometimes things need to get done without a committee vote. You're not big on formalities, are you? I'm with them right up until they keep people from doing their jobs. There. I just saved you about nine days of running around. That said, you should head up to the Presidium and tell them you're still alive. The Council probably wants to talk to the one who saved their scaly asses. I will. Having access to the Council and the Spectre's resources would be useful. Yeah. The Council can get anything. Best thing about working CSEC is that any equipment, information, or money you need, you get. Anyway, something else you need? Or can I get back to work? How'd you end up working on the Citadel? I started with the Alliance way back when, but the traveling was killing me. It's a shitty life if you're trying to raise a family, seeing your kids every six months. I joined CSEC so I could stay in one place and put down roots. You like life here on the Citadel? Yeah, life here is good. Hell of a lot different than life back on Earth. I miss the food, mostly. You just can't get sockeye salmon here on the station. You ever get back there? Earth, every couple of years, less and less all the time. But when I finish my stint with CSEC, there's a nice little place in the foothills I'm gonna retire to. Not that I'm retiring anytime soon. It looks like most of the damage from Sovereign's attack has been repaired. The Presidium was pretty shot up, of course. They fixed that first. All the words got hit with debris when the ship exploded. Most of the damage was superficial, and the Keepers got things restored fast. Tasery Ward got the worst. A big chunk hit near the Dillanaga Concert Hall. They're still clearing wreckage and trying to get power restored. Ja, Matriarch Dillanaga kennen wir ja noch. Von der haben wir die ganzen, ähm... Um It looks like most of the damage from Sovereign's attack is done. Uh, da haben wir die ganzen ähm, Schriftstücke des Damage. Ah, uh, Sekaro. Ja. Tell me about this place. All the wards are more or less multicultural, but the other four are dominated by Asari, Turians, or Solarians. In Zekira, we've got major enclaves of Volus, Elcor, and Hanar. There's also a human commercial zone at Shin Akiba. We've got a few Krogan walking around, and I think I saw a quarry in the other day. <coughs> I overheard your conversation. Make him scream a little? This isn't a Presidium. All they have to worry about are protesters outside their free speech zones or someone's poodle crapping on the grass. Down here, we have drugs, organized crime, and murder. Policing a ward is like policing New York City. Sometimes you have to work outside the Council's rulebook. Tja, und obwohl ähm, er jetzt so ein bisschen rau erscheint, ist Bailey ähm, mit Sicherheit einer der, der ähm, integersten ähm, Charaktere in, im ganzen Universum. Last time I was here, there were no human captains in CSEC. No, CSEC took a lot of casualties when the Geth boarded the Presidium. The Special Response Division was hard hit. They stopped turning their noses up at human resumes. They needed bodies in uniform, and we had the most experienced bodies. I should be going. You need anything else? Let me know. I will. Uh. Nee, ich. Nee, sorry, aber ich will jetzt nicht mit Avina reden. Das bringt uns, glaube ich, echt gar nichts. Good day, my friends. Welcome to the Citadel. Since these stores are owned by the Council, do government employees get a discount? Yes, in fact. Uh, what's your position? I'm a former Spectre. My goodness! I didn't know Spectres quit. I don't believe you qualify for a discount, though. How about if I throw in an endorsement from the woman who defeated Saren? You are Shepard? My goodness. The increase in sales would certainly be worth offering a discount. What do you need me to do? Just voice your endorsement into my console. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. Excellent. I will get my clerical VI to add it to our advertising immediately. Space Hamster, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, um... Model... Model... And the fish gibt's später. I heard that those lakes up on the Presidium are filled with fish. No 
No, they're not. You ever been up there? No. CSEC won't let me. They say I'm a risk. Uh, they think every Krogan is dangerous. Damn Turians. We should kill them all. <lacht> ich mag Krogane einfach. <lacht> ah. Ja, leider ist die Citadel hier sehr eingeschränkt. Ihr seht also auch die Citadel ist hier sehr orange. What can I do for you? I thought weapons were restricted on the Citadel now. Carrying them around is. Selling them isn't. We store them in off-site containers and deliver them to your ship. People who have permission to carry, like CSEC, can walk out with them. I'd like to buy something. Try our electronic catalog interface. That kiosk over there. Tell me about your services. We sell quality hunting supplies, which you'll need when you purchase one of our adventure travel packages. Imagine it, human. The break of day. You and your team have been stalking a Shafa for five days. In that time, it's killed four men. You see it? Line it up. Take the shot. Blam! It's down. You're the hero. That's what we offer. Not a vacation, but an experience. Your expeditions might be a little tame for me. Tame? A human can hardly take down a feral Varen, let alone a Shatha. Who do you think you are? Well, my name's Shepard, and I... The Shepard? The one that put down Saren Arterius? Oh, you do know me. By the spirits! Shepard, in my store! I don't suppose I could convince you to record an advertisement for me. Sure you could. Can we work out a discount? A discount? I'd name my firstborn after you if you ask. Can we record it now? Just speak towards my console. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. <lacht> no other gun shop has that kind of endorsement. Ja, äh, also es ist auch mal wieder so, wo man sich per Paragon so ein bisschen ähm, was erschleimen kann. Ich habe ja schon mal gesagt, dass es gar nicht immer so selbstlos ist. Ähm, interessanterweise, ich hatte beim allerersten Durchgang ähm, das Council geopfert. Und hab gesagt, nee, konzentriert euch auf ähm, Sovereign. Und dann hat er immer gesagt, ja, oh, Mirk, die, die Tür soll dich erschlagen, wenn du rausgehst. Und er war super unfreundlich zu mir. Und beim zweiten Mal habe ich halt das Council ähm, gerettet. Und er ist wie ausgewechselt. Fand ich, fand ich sehr interessant. Eine kleine Änderung nur, aber... Ähm We can use this. Das hier ist auch sehr gut. Have you tried Galaxy of Fantasy yet? I love that game. It's based on Turian mythology, but it's really fun. I hear it has 11 billion players now. Do you have any games you'd like to trade in? You get two credits toward a new game. You know what's good? Alliance Corsair. The battles are pretty realistic, but it's still fun. And you can install it on an Omni Tour. wenig ähm doch von Looking for a little R&R Shepherd. It's a nice enough place. A lot nicer than Cora's den anyway. I wasn't sorry to hear they never reopened after the Geth attack. <coughs> Will it be? Hear about anything interesting going on around here? Serve drinks. You want to know what's going on? Check the news. I don't know why humans always ask me that. I'm done for now. Let me know if you change your mind. Ähm wo ist er denn? Yes, sir. Something I can do for you? I noticed you're one of the groundskeepers for the Presidium. Do you know if there are fish in the lakes? I get that question a lot. I think it's right behind where's the restroom. Those are reservoirs. The Presidium's own supply, independent from the water storage tanks in the wards. The only place I know of on the station to get a live fish 
is the Leia Sonnesi's gift shop. When I pour a glass of water, it's the same stuff tourists throw garbage in. No, they purify it first. If some solarian or human bacteria gets left in, and a Turian or Quarian drinks it, they could die. Everything would be so much simpler if we all had the same DNA. But no, the universe loves diversity. Thanks for your time. No problem. If you get up to the Presidium, check out the Demile flowers across from the conduit. They're coming in very nicely. A conduit, yeah, ja, damit hatten wir ja sehr viel zu tun. Ja, ihr habt's gesehen. Ich habe einen Zwischenspeicher gemacht und es ist nicht das halbe Spiel äh, zum Erliegen gekommen. Kalisa Benzin an Algelani. Kalisa Benzin an Algelani, Westerlin News. I interviewed you two years ago when you first became a specter. You presented your case very well on camera. Do you have a minute? What, so you can try to do another smear job on me? Now, Shepard, you may object to my methods, but we're on the same side. Your bath, your news. I just want to give your story its due. Sources claim you were at the heart of the Presidium during the Battle of the Citadel. It's fair to say the course of the battle hinged on your words. If true, you told Admiral Hackett to assist the Destiny Ascension, costing hundreds of human lives, and securing the continued dominance of the Citadel Council. The Turians lost 20 cruisers. Figure each had a crew of around 300. The Ascension, the Asari dreadnought we saved, had a crew of nearly 10,000. But surely the human cost. The Alliance lost eight cruisers. Shen Yang, Emden, Jakarta, Cairo, Seoul, Cape Town, Warsaw, Madrid, and yes, I remember them all. Everyone in the Fifth Fleet is a hero. The Alliance owes them all medals. The Council owes them a lot more than that. And so do you. Commander Shepard, first human specter, hero of the Battle of the Citadel. Check bid. We get it? Great. Bull rushed on my own show. Ja, es gibt ja Leute, die die gerne verprügeln. Ich, ähm. Ich bin lieber jemand, der so ein bisschen mit ihr redet. Been years since I've been to the Citadel. Never changes, does it? No matter how long you're gone. Comforting to some people, I guess. Living in denial that all this could end. Ich glaube, wir können uns hier ein Taxi nehmen. Ähm. Dann sind wir hier und haben hier schon wieder eine Nebenquest. I'm sorry, I'm trying to take a statement here. There's nothing to talk about. She stole my credit shit. Arrest her. I did not! Just because I'm a Quarian! I need you to stop and take a deep breath. You're mocking me, Earth Clan. Just because the Vault Clan need... It was a poor choice of words, sir. I apologize. You say you're falsely accused? I was walking to the used ship dealer when he barged into me outside the Serta Foundation. He didn't stop or say he was sorry. A minute later, he runs up with C-Sec and accuses me of stealing his damn shit. Do you spend a lot of time with the used ship dealer? Yeah. They've got a lot of nice models. I'd like to buy one and take it back to the fleet, but... A ship would make a great pilgrimage gift. You know about the pilgrimage? I traveled with Quarian, who was on hers. I... Wow. I didn't know anyone here would do that for one of us. Do you know who's telling the truth? My Omni tool can tell the Quarian doesn't have a chit on her. But she could have stashed it to recover later. You know what Quarians are like. <laughs> and she's definitely a vagrant. I'll run her in and see what Bailey wants to do with her. 
You say she stole your credit chit? She must have. When I left the Serta Foundation store, she ran right into me. How does running into you mean she stole your credit chit? That's how pickpockets work. They bump into you and use that as a cover for rifling your pockets. You can't turn your back on these clanless quarians. Thieves. All of them. Are you sure you didn't leave your chit at the Serta Foundation? Of course not. You think I'd make a mistake like that? I didn't even buy anything there. That chit stayed in my pocket. I'll see if I can find out what happened. Ma'am, <coughs> this is a sec matter. We'll do all we can. All we can to resolve this. We don't need civilian help. If you do happen to find the chit, please let one of our officers know. Let's go. Be careful out there. Yeah. Es ähm, geht hier natürlich, ähm, ich denke, das ist recht offensichtlich um Racial Profiling. What do you think, Michael? Maybe the Immuno Booster? It's supposed to help with alien bacteria. We can get whatever you'd like for little Jake, Rebecca. Wait, the Immuno Booster can delay muscle development in high gravity environments. What if that hurts him? Die beiden kennen wir noch aus Teil 1. Good day, citizen. Welcome to the Serta Foundation Outlet on Zakara Ward. I couldn't help but notice your prices. They seem a bit steep. With respect, the Foundation is not concerned with profits. A portion of our sales funds research to cure genetic diseases. You know it would make your services more popular. An endorsement from the woman who defeated Saren. Oh my! You're Shepard, aren't you? I would be glad to give you my employee discount if you would do that for us. It's a deal. Just speak into my console here. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. I'll work it into our advertising at once. Thank you. Yeah. Manage life support webbing. Mm. Das sieht mir doch ganz nett aus, ansonsten. The nerve enhancements say that there are occasional motor control. Marab? Ah, hier. Welcome to Sarenus Applications. Can I address you? Ah, Shepard! Do I know you? No, but I know you. Even a senile Hanar would remember the human who fought off the Geth. I thought you were dead. Yeah, I've been getting that a lot. Please, look around the store. It's a pleasure to have you here. You know, I use quite a bit of software in my line of work. It's a shame so few understand their own equipment. Besides the most obvious point-and-go nav interfaces, anyway. You wouldn't believe how often I hear, Why is the ship turning around? We're only halfway there. <laughs> oh, I would. You know, I like your products. Any interest in an endorsement from the human who defeated Saren? I'd be thrilled. But I don't think I could afford to pay you for it. Don't worry about it. What if we just work out a discount? Absolutely. Just speak into my console here. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store in the Citadel. That will be splendid. I can edit that and have it working right away. Thank you so much. Ja. So kann man sich auch wirklich... Das waren jetzt, glaube ich, schon bei den ganzen Stores. Waren es, glaube ich, schon 20. Um, damage Protection auf jeden Fall. This should come in handy. Tech Damage. Exit. Uh, I'm wait. Commander Shepard, and this is ah my favorite customer. What can a I get? Volus was in here not too long ago. Did he drop a credit chit? Oh, yes. He bought some environmental system drivers, then left without his chit. I didn't notice he'd left until he was already gone. If you see him, tell him I have it here behind the counter. Thanks for your time. I'll be here if you need anything. Und ihr habt ja schon gehört, dann wenn man in die Läden reingeht, kommt direkt dieser Spruch. You ever had ramen? It's a delicacy back on Earth. Please move along. You forgot your credit shit at Saranus Applications. The clerk's holding it for you. Oh. Well. 
the Quarian could have stolen it. I'll close this event report, but I'll be watching you. Get a permanent residence, or I'll run you in for me. Are you too serious? What? You falsely accused this girl of stealing from you. All you have to say now is that she could have stolen it? Now, just a minute! And you. She gets harassed and insulted by this guy, and you throw in a threat to arrest her for vagrancy. How about if I run you in for obstruction of justice? You think you're gonna run in a former Spectre? I think both of you should get out of here. Oh, son of a... Thank you. I... I wish I could give you something more than words. Can you take care of yourself from here? I guess. I mean, most nights I eat nutrient paste in the Turian shelter. But I'm surviving. Thanks. Ja, also diese beiden Idioten. Weil wirklich war es jetzt echt dann noch ähm, äh, Victim Blaming halt wirklich. Ähm, statt also sie war jetzt offensichtlich ein Opfer einer ähm, Falschbeschuldigung äh, und dann immer noch, ja, ich äh, hau ab hier oder ich, äh, ich äh, drehe dir noch was an. Ähm, I hear this is the best geht ja einfach mal gar nicht. High Grade Provisions. Jawohl. Äh, ja, und die Bücher von äh, Drew Caption, äh, was natürlich, also das sind die echten Bücher, ähm, die es halt zu Mass Effect gibt. Und das war natürlich der gleiche Sprecher wie bei Garus, den wir auf jeden Fall noch treffen werden. So viel äh, habe ich ja schon mal gespoilert. What do you want? Why are you so interested in fish from the Presidium? It's so decadent. Eating a fish from the Presidium would be like screwing Shaira. Ugh, I'm sorry you're so squishy. Where are you supposed to get a decent grip? I talked to one of the Presidium groundskeepers. He said there aren't any fish in the lakes. What? I told you. Why have all that water if you're not going to store something to eat in it? I don't understand aliens at all. Thanks for telling me. Ja, dann hätten wir die Quest Krogan Sushi auch mal abgeklärt. This is depressing. How about we find a Turian and beat the crap out of it? That always makes you feel better. You think there's any place on board we could buy a fish? Ja, da drüben. I don't like live animals on the Citadel. Wasted life support capacity, they say. I can't believe there aren't any fish up there. It must be a mistake. Can we talk about something else now? This is depressing. How about we find a Turian and beat the crap out of it? That always makes you feel better. Presidium. This meeting would be more productive if Udina was to join us. My advisor is unavailable. As counselor, I represent the voice of humanity and the Alliance. Shepard will be here and... Oh, Commander! We were just talking about you. It's been a long time, Anderson. I hope the last couple years have treated you right. There have been some rough spots. It's good to have you back. We've heard many rumors surrounding your unexpected return. Some of them are... unsettling. We called this meeting so you could explain your actions, Shepard. We owe you that much. After all, you saved our lives in the battle against Saren and his geth. The Collectors are abducting human colonists in the Terminus systems. Worse, we think they're working for the Reapers. The Terminus systems are beyond our jurisdiction. Your colonists knew this when they left Council Space. You're missing the important part, Counselor. The Reapers are involved. Ah, yes, Reapers. The immortal race of sentient starships, allegedly waiting in dark space. Well, we have dismissed that claim. Shepard, no one else encountered the hologram on Ilos that told you the truth about the Reapers. Only you and your crew ever spoke with Sovereign. I believe you. But without evidence from another source, the others think Saren was behind the Geth attacks. Saren was an organic. The Geth would never accept him as their leader. They only followed him because he was Sovereign's agent. 
Saren was a compelling and charismatic individual. He convinced the Geth the Reapers were real, just as he convinced you. It was part of his plan to attack the Citadel. The Reapers are just a myth, one you insist on perpetuating. We believe that you believe it, but that doesn't make it true. Go back to Ilos and talk to Vigil. Or just look at what's left of Sovereign. It's obvious the technology is more advanced than ours. The hologram on Ilos is no longer functional, and we have found nothing to suggest that Sovereign was not a Geth creation. The Geth are capable of remarkable technological achievements. This is probably why Saren recruited them. This Reaper theory proves just how fragile your mental state is. You have been manipulated by Cerberus, and before them, by Saren. I kept Saren from conquering the Citadel. I sacrificed human lives to save this council. We are in a difficult position, Shepard. You are working for Cerberus, an avowed enemy of the Council. This is treason, a capital offense. That's too far. Shepard is a hero. I'm on this Council too, and I won't let this whitewash continue. Maybe there is a compromise, not a public acknowledgement given your ties, but something to show peripheral support. Shepard, if you keep a low profile and restrict your operations to the Terminus systems, the Council is willing to offer you reinstatement as a Spectre. What does that mean? Will I need to start filing reports? That won't be necessary. This is a show of good faith on our part. We cannot become involved in an investigation regarding the missing colonies in the Terminus systems. But Spectre reinstatement shows our support of you personally. I accept your offer. It's good to have the Council on my side. Good luck with your investigation, Shepard. We hope for a quick resolution and a quick end to your relationship with Cerberus. Well, that went better than expected. You realize the Council's offer is just symbolic. They won't actually do anything. Even if they don't help, I might as well stay on good terms. True enough. Don't worry about the Council or the Alliance. I'll find some way to keep them off your back. Shouldn't be too hard. As long as you keep to the Terminus systems. Anderson, we need to talk about... Shepard, what are you doing here? Stop by to see how Anderson was doing. You don't have to cover for me. I invited Shepard here to speak with the Consul. We just finished our meeting. You what? Consular, do the words political shitstorm mean anything to you? The Council reinstated my Spectre status. They're just happy I'm staying out in the Terminus systems. Yes, I could see how that arrangement works best for both sides. But you really shouldn't have taken a step like this without consulting with me first, Consulate. I don't answer to you, Udina. Why don't you go to your office and think about that for a while? Of course, Consulate. Good day to both of you. Sorry about that. Udina's never gotten over the fact that I got the Council position instead of him. Sometimes I need to put him in his place. Udina's just doing his job. True enough. He's got his uses. And if you want something done on the Citadel, he knows who can make it happen. Plus, he's always happy to attend all those formal diplomatic functions I can't be bothered with. How have the last couple years treated you? <coughs> Serving on the Council isn't how I plan to spend my twilight years. Sometimes it feels like I'm just beating my head against a wall. Knowing the truth about Sovereign is brutal. It's nightmare stuff. I can't blame others for not wanting to believe it, but I know how important it is. So I keep trying. Fighting the good fight, right? Forget Udina and the Council. Join my crew and help me stop the Collectors. I'm too old to go racing across the galaxy. Much as I complain, I've got an important job to do here. The front line. That's got to be yours. How long did it take to get this place back up to speed after the battle? Still counting. The main areas of commerce and the most populated wards are complete. But estimates for total restoration are sitting around five years. The Keepers always surprise us, though. It's like our repairs are annoying. We'll put up an ugly new bulkhead, and in a few days, they've made it seamless. We never really thought of them as heavy lifters, and I have no idea where they get the resources. But we'd never get done without them. Das hatten wir doch schon. Was die? I'm surprised no one can tell Sovereign isn't Geth technology. 
Didn't they examine the wreckage? We don't have much to look at. Pieces of it rained all over the station. It was chaos, with who knows how many species combing the wards for their dead. We secured as much of it as we could. But between the keepers and a whole lot of unauthorized salvage, there's no way to account for even half of that thing. Another reason why they don't want to acknowledge what Sovereign was. Ja, als die Keeper, dass die ja ähm, die Citadel immer schön sauber halten, damit keinem auffällt, dass sie in der Falle ist und der dieses eine Viech ist da jetzt gerade irgendwie verschwunden. Äh, Chor. Last I knew we were still fighting holdouts. Well, here and there. But they are increasingly disorganized. It's long since stopped being called a war. More like cleanup. Not that you can ever discount them. But we haven't had serious casualties for months. A civilian ship will spot an enclave and we send in a squad to clear it. They're not quite the boogeymen they used to be. What happened to Staff Lieutenant Alenko after the Normandy was destroyed? Staff Commander Alenko is still with the Alliance. But he's working on a special mission. It's classified. I can't say any more. Not while you're working with Cerberus, I'm sorry. I better go. Of course, Shepard, I understand. I wish I could do more to help you. But if you ever want to talk, I'll be here. Just do me a favor and be careful. You can't trust Cerberus. Ah, die Bildstörungen nerven mich immer noch ein bisschen, aber naja. Mit denen müssen wir wohl leben. Ah, Norman, die war ganz oben. Ja, okay. Ja, das... Also meinetwegen können wir mal Commander, noch kurz you've a new message at your private terminal. mit Kasumi reden. People are talking out there, and I hear it all. I usually travel hidden away in cargo bays. It's nice to be able to look out a window for a change. Mess Sergeant Gardner might just be an evil genius. Emphasis on the evil. People think he's a bad cook on purpose, like he's trying to teach them a lesson. I think his ramen is okay, but it's really hard to ruin ramen. That's my favorite piece, painted for me by a child prodigy from Elysium. She was the cutest thing. She was kidnapped by slavers who hoped to sell her on Omega. I wasn't about to let that happen. I set up an idea as a buyer's rep to get a special tour of the slaver's vessel. Once aboard, I freed the girl and smuggled her off the ship. She painted that for me on the way home. I'll never forget how it felt to watch her work. Don't laugh, I like those books. Romance novels, crime novels, the classics. There's something about the feel of actual paper in your hands, their musty smell. It's relaxing. Keiji used to find books for me while on the job. Some of these are more valuable than the objects he was hired to steal. I stole that on a dare, believe it or not. There was a big museum show coming to Ilium. Artifacts from Earth going on tour. Very high security. KG dared me to steal this. So I broke in, hacked the security, put a few guards to sleep, and replaced the piece with a worthless duplicate. They never knew the difference. My first museum job. Nowhere near the last. The Red Rose. That used to be my calling card when I first started out. In place of whatever I took, I left a single Red Rose. It wasn't until I met Keiji that I realized how silly it was. He had a way of making you realize when you were just being sentimental. I'm not really sure what to do with myself. Not much call for thievery aboard a ship. Come back later. I'm sure I'll have more to talk about. That painting has a special place in my heart. An art collector hired me to steal it. When I got there, the painting was gone. On the way out, I saw it being hauled off by another thief. I chased him down, tackled him, and took the painting. That's how KG and I met. We never did turn it into our employers. Hm. 
Tja. Commander, those provisions you provided were perfect. I owe you. I've already thrown together some of my calamari gumbo. Here, try a bite. Truth told, it's based on an Asari recipe. Seems a little cannibalistic to me with their tentacle heads and all, but they ain't no good grub. Anyway, thanks again. You really came through. How may I help you, Commander? I have a present for you, Doc. Ceres ice brandy? You didn't. Oh, Doc. <laughs> Thank you. I always regretted not opening that original bottle when I still could. I won't make the same mistake again. Why don't we open this bottle right here, right now? You and me. You crack open the bottle. I'll get the glasses. <laughs> I thought Olenko's biotic display might have broken Jenkins' back, but Jenkins pops up and yells, that was awesome. <laughs> Oh, Jenkins. Soldiers like him make the Alliance great. Cerberus lacks the same enthusiasm. With your service record, you could have gotten a tour of duty on any Alliance ship. Why'd you really leave? Maybe it's less about leaving and more about staying. As a military doctor, I mostly treat people who are in bad shape. Often they die. And if I can help them, they move on. By the way, they leave. Don't you have any friends or family? No, not lacking friendship. Just stability. Jeff, Joker will always have Rolic syndrome. He would never admit it, but he needs my help, and he always will. I wish it weren't, but sadly, it's true. Treating Joker gives you a kind of stability. So does this ship, even if it's a copy. Or, hell, maybe it's you, Shepard. Our removable center. A place for a person to stop and catch her breath. Or maybe I'm just happily drunk. Would it hurt if it was simple like that for once? Here's to simply being happily drunk. I'll drink to that. Ja, dann haben wir halt mal mit Dr. Chuck was einen durchgemacht. <lacht> Finde ich eine super sympathische Szene und äh, ja, ähm, sie liegt hier und ist fertig und Shepard, ihr seht, ähm, ist auch ein bisschen tüdelig. Immer noch so ein bisschen jetzt, glaube ich nicht mehr. Earlier when we spoke, you were very open with me. I like that. But I hope I didn't come across as too flirty. I don't want to overstep my bounds. You're very charming, Kelly. Thank you. The feeling is mutual. Anyway, how may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages at your private terminal. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. Take care. Thank you again. Ah, Samish Bhatia. Mr. Rudina, ja, äh... Also, wir hatten ja, ähm, seine Frau war ja leider auf Eden Prime, ähm, von den Geth getötet worden. Und wir hatten, ähm, ihm ermöglicht, dass er dann wenigstens ihren, äh, Körper bestatten konnte. Und, ähm, ja, yeah, I, I have opened the restaurant that my wife owned always wish to start back on earth. Nirali's Nier picture hangs on the wall and the line soldiers eat free. It is the least I can do to honor the courage with which both you and my and my wife have served humanity. Also um, in seinem Restaurant, das um, eigentlich das war, was seine Frau öffnen wollte, können Allianz Soldaten um, umsonst essen, weil sie ja, um, also sie und Shepard ja beide um, auch in der Allianz tätig waren. Ja, ich würde sagen, das ist doch ein guter Abschluss für die Folge. 
wieder mal sehr viel Gelaber, aber das ähm, gehört zum Mass Effect einfach dazu. Es ist halt eben nicht nur Geballer. Ja. Dann würde ich sagen, bis zum nächsten Mal.